All right, looking at number 10 here, we have an optically active D alto pentos. Apparently that dragged my pen. All right, so alto pentos, we have a CHO, three intersection CH2, OH, and the only thing the D tells us is that's a location. All right, if treated with aldehyde acid it was optically inactive All right well that's fine optically inactive tells us we had symmetry after we added the autotol because the autotol would have just turned the top and the bottom into TDH2OH and inactive implies symmetry so I know that we had to be mirrored right along here All right so I know my auto pentos I know top and bottom position. I don't know that middle location, but we did rough degradation of it, made an auto tetros. That rips off the top location, moves it off, and we just shorten the chain. So this is still D tetros, and it is optically inactive. Optically inactive autotol tells us the OH was there, therefore this was an OH, and that was an OH. So we have to have a uh, auto pentose with all of our alcohols on one side.